everyone, this is Ms. Helms, and by the end of this video, you should be able to determine and apply relationships among inscribed and central angles. In this problem, we are asked to solve for the missing information in the diagram below. So what we are looking for is both the variable x, and we are also looking for the measurement of angle x. Taking a look at our diagram, we can see that xz is a diameter because it goes it's a chord that goes to the center of the circle. So therefore, arc XYZ has to be 180 degrees because it's a semicircle or half of the circle. So what we can do to solve for our variable X is we can take the two arcs that were given, so 6 plus 7X or arc YZ plus 5X plus 6 or arc XY and set that equal to 180 degrees because that is the measurement of a semicircle. So combining our like terms, we get 12x plus, combining our other like terms, 12 is equal to 180. To solve, we're going to use inverse operations, subtract 12 from both sides. So we get 12x is equal to 168. Solve for x, we're going to divide 12 from both sides. x is equal to... 14. Now that we've solved for the variable x, the next question is to solve for the measure of angle x. So taking a look at this diagram, well, angle x is an inscribed angle, so I'm just going to highlight angle x here. So by highlighting it, we see that angle x opens up to arc yz. So if we know the measurement of arc yz, we can solve for the measurement of angle x. So to solve for the measure, of arc yz, we're going to substitute in x into our expression. So we have 6 plus 7 times 14. We're going to go ahead and solve this. So the measure of arc yz is equal to 104 degrees. So now that we know the measure of arc yz, to solve for the measure of angle x, we're going to take the arc yz which is 104, and we're going to divide it by 2 because we previously learned that the relationship between the inscribed angle and the arc that it intercepts or the arc that it opens up to, the measure of the angle is half the measure of that arc. So therefore, the measure of angle X is going to be 52 degrees. Nice work!